everyone, Kerry here. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing great today. So today I have another video for you guys that this is going to be part of my save file actually. This is a community lot and it's actually a pet cafe. I originally wanted to build a cat cafe, but then I thought that dogs deserve that space as well. And seems that our dog owners deserve their space as well. So I just decided to turn this into a pet cafe. So your sims can actually bring here their cats, their dogs. Um, well, that's the only animals that you can bring. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this build is actually des uh, designed for... Uh, pet owners that come here and have some cafe or anything to drink or eat and I actually really like this build it's something I've been wanting to build for a long time now but I just started to build like two or three times this build and then I didn't like it so I let it there so I I would um, go back to it sometime and I just decided that I wanted to build it and as it's been a while since I built something that is not into the country style or more cottage core vibes I just decided to go for this that it's a little bit more modern even a little bit um, industrial if you see how the second floor looks like but it's basically a modern build I thought it would be great to have this and as, as I said this is going to be part of my save file so this is built in Newcrest in one of the smallest lots in Newcrest in the top right corner of the map. This is actually pretty close to another cafe that I have that is uh, Mama's Little Bakery in case you've missed it. Uh, I'm gonna put the link in the here in the in the video <laughs> so you can see it. But yeah, it's pretty close to it. But the difference that is this is actually made for pet owners and the other one is just a bakery. So yeah, I really like this build. Basically, I have never built, I've never been to a cat cafe or a pet cafe in my life. I've seen them, but I've never uh, been inside one of those. So I don't know how they how they work. I don't know how they look like in the interior. So in the interior, so I had to Google for a lot of inspiration picture for this, and I actually really like it. I like that we have these um, signs that have cats and dogs and things like that that we got with cats and dogs, and I just really like this because on the back of this build you actually have like a play area for your pets so you can have your dogs playing outside you still have some tables so you can go and have a coffee or something there while your pet is playing but uh, first of all uh, what I want to say before I continue talking about this build is that if my voice sounds weird it's because I'm getting a cold <laughs> Um, I've started this morning with a sore throat, so I'm pretty sure I'm getting a cold because my partner was sick and I went to visit him. Uh, don't worry, nothing serious. He got tested and he didn't have any serious viruses. So yeah, in case, um, my voice sounds weird or if I don't put many videos in the next couple of days, it's basically because I am not able to talk at all <laughs> because every time I get a cold um, it goes straight to my throat and then my ear and it starts um, soaring and yeah it hurts uh, quite a lot so yeah in case you don't see me for a few more days it's basically because I'm recovering from a cold <laughs> but yeah um, sorry if I've been so absent I've been going through a lot of things in my life in the last couple of weeks I haven't felt really inspired to do anything in general I mean I've been building a lot but I just don't like I haven't felt like editing videos or doing voiceovers lately so yeah I'm really really sorry if my channel has been kind of uh, neglected in the last couple of weeks but I'm trying to um, make it better and I'm trying to get uh, feel better with all the things that I'm going through right now and yeah personal life it just uh it can suck sometimes <laughs> but yeah uh I'm a straight I'm, I'm, a, I'm a strong girl I'm gonna recover from this and I'm gonna be doing more voiceovers and more, vid more videos for you guys um in the next uh, upcoming days and weeks and yeah I just really enjoy this but yeah as you can see here as I said I have never been to a pet cafe in my life so I don't know how they look like but I thought it would be interesting to have a lot of shelves for your cats to climb on and to have of course some uh, cat trees and also a lot of uh, toy chests for your pets 
So you have uh, pet beds as well. I put some pet beds next to the tables as well in case you want to have your dog or your cat really uh, next to you while you're sitting there and eating or drinking or whatever you're doing in there so yeah I put a lot of things that would make your pet feel really uh, happy about this and um, I just really like it and I decided to put some shelves on the windows as well and some shelves um, on the walls so your cats can go and climb and ju they just have a, a nice time and I put those in also in the windows in the front basically because if you walk through uh you're you're walking on the street and you look to the build you can see some cats climbing in the on the windows and i thought it would be nice to have that i decided to add this ladder that i actually custom made with base game wood planks from the debug catalog i have it uploaded on my gallery in case you want to download it but i decided to add that so your cats can actually climb there of course um your cats in the game will not climb on the shelves and would not climb that ladder that I created. But for realistic purposes, I thought it would be cool to have something like that. So your cats could go and just lay down in the shelves and stuff like that. Of course, I had to put a lot of these um, stickers on the walls because it's... It, it, this is for pets basically <laughs> so yeah this um build doesn't have an apartment on the second floor or an apartment at all so in case you want to have this um this cafe and you want your sims to live in here uh you won't be able to do that basically because i wanted to have a two floor um cafe so you could have more space for your sims to come and you will have more um uh, more guests coming over and an open area here for the nice days uh, the sunny days and you can come here and have your dogs laying around and you have of course a lot of uh, pet food bowls for your pets as well um, I don't think this uh, section on the second floor would be really appropriate for cats basically because they can jump and climb a, a lot uh, and realistically speaking, <laughs> but in terms of the Sims, of course, you can have them because they're not going to jump from the second floor. So I put that uh, cat tree over there and, of course, a lot of toys. And as I said on the bag, I decided to have this closed section here and just put more tables and some toys and these training things that we got with cats and dogs for, uh, for your Sims to train their dogs. So I thought that would be cool. And also I decided to add a swing set in case you come with kids so kids can do something as well. Uh, sorry if you can hear my cat <laughs> in the back. But yeah, I just thought it would be cool to have more open areas and to have uh, things for your Sims to do as well. As it's not just for the adult uh, Sims to come here and drink coffee. It, it could uh, work perfectly fine as well for your Sims uh, to come with their kids and do some other stuff. But yeah, we're actually coming to the end of the video now. So I hope you guys like it. Once again, sorry if I've been really absent. I'm trying to get better at this. So if you like this build, you want to download it from the gallery, you can do it because it's already uploaded. You can find it um, with my ID, which is, which is Carrie Sims as always. And also follow me on social media. Links are all in the description down below. Remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Enjoy the screenshots. Goodbye.